everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Julie and I do handbag reviews. And if you're not new, welcome back guys. It's so great to see you. Sorry, it's been a minute since I've done a video. I mean, it's been like over a month and for me, that's kind of a long time, but I thought I would just kind of jump in here today. Today is the first day of daylight savings time. So we have a lot more daylight longer. It does mess with your sleep schedule if you're not careful, but it's great because the light is longer. And I am kind of one of those people that really kind of gets fueled up by light in the day and kind of like dark nights just kind of makes you feel a little moody and blue. So when it's daylight savings time, I actually kind of like this time. So. Either way, I wanted to do a different video today. So today is gonna be like a couple oh, segments. So <laughs> I am going to show you my Cassie 19 collection that I have. And then I'm gonna do at the end of the video, like a bag switch from the bag I'm currently using, which is actually my, um, it's my Proenza Schooler PS1. This is the color Royal Blue. Probably my favorite bag in my collection, not gonna lie. I just got the gray one and absolutely love it um, in the medium size. So I'm gonna switch out of this and go into one of my Cassie 19s and kind of show you how I will have to somewhat downsize to go into the Cassie 19 purse. So let's go ahead and get things started. Um, just a little background, I really like the Cassie line, I pretty much prefer now strictly just the Cassie 19 over the regular Cassie. I don't know, um, Erin, the handbag housewife, and I have kind of chatted about this. She's kind of the same way. The Cassie regular is a little too skinny and we kind of like the width of what a Cassie 19 bag would have. So I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of get started. I have three to show you. Um, one, this one in particular. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. So this is the first one. This is um, one that I bought off of my Coach Collective group um, from a gal who watches my channel and it is absolutely beautiful. It's, um, it is signature print, white chalk, and then on the sides, this color is, hmm. It's like a flax color and it's absolutely beautiful. It's kind of like a mustard yellow and it is slightly burnished. You can kind of tell here that the leather has like a darker to lighter effect. And just like with all the Cassie 19s, it comes with this cute little top handle here. Um, and so this bag is really cute too because it has red glazing. So it has this raspberry red glazing on the sides. The interior lining on the signature canvas ones is a like a textile lining. It's not the silky satiny ones. It is a, it's a textile and this is raspberry. So absolutely beautiful. Love the inner compartments. This one in particular, when I bought it, did not have the um, coach chain strap, but I did pick up one. So it has like the full set. It does have the crossbody strap, which is in that same beautiful color of the mustard yellow. And then here is the, of course, the Cassie 19 chain strap. So this is my first one. I really think it's cute. I'm excited to use this one in the summertime a lot and just perfect for vacation. In fact, we just scheduled our beach vacation for the first week of summer. And I think this is gonna be coming along with me because it's gonna be perfect for, um, you know, for the season and it's small, it's compact. It does have the nice width and these accordion out really well. So I can carry quite a bit for the kids. So that is Cassie 19 number one. Cassie 19 number two is this just plain black one. So this is one that's just plain black in the polished pebbled leather. This one is all over YouTube. It's not anything to write home about. This is a repurchase for me actually. I did have this one before and sold it. Now it's back and I love it. It is absolutely perfect. 
You can't go wrong with the black Cassie 19. I also think the chalk one in the leather is really good too for, I mean, this bag is so versatile, you guys, because it has the chain strap, it has the crossbody strap, it has the top handle also. You can wear it casual or dressy, rock it with the chain strap whenever you would go to like an evening event. It's just the perfect black bag. The back has a slip pocket and it just has the, you know, plain sides on it. Brass hardware with the C turn lock closure. The ones with the signature print is an oval closure without the C. And then the ones that are solid leather, even color block, color block leather will have the C turn lock. So, um, and then on the inside here, silk. A satiny, true Cassie lining, not the textile. It's It's got coach written on it and it's more silky satiny. And then this one really kind of expands out wide, but you can fit so much as I'll show you into these bags. They're just like little mini clown cars and just, just a delight to carry. I think they're just so good. Love these bags so much. Um, and so this one, when did I get this one? I got this one in the month of January, which was my birthday month. I picked it up at the Coach Retail, retail Store, got it 10% off just because it was my birthday month. I did pay a little more than what I wanted to for it. Truly, I try to get these bags like half price, but at the time I was just like, oh, I really, really want it back. So got this one and then off to my final one. This one is, I think my favorite one. So this is the Coach Cassie in the signature rust canvas and it's absolutely gorgeous. So I did add, and I don't know if I'm gonna use these or not, but these are just coach. Well, they're not real coach extenders. I did get them off Amazon, but I added it to the top handle strap so you can kind of see how you can kind of extend. This is the top handle strap and I just extended it with the extenders to wear it then as a shoulder bag like that. Um, so did get this one. I picked this up off super sale. I don't even know where, I think off like 24S. I got it like 50% off thanks to Handbag Housewife. <laughs> thanks Erin, you always give us the best tips on where to shop for like heck of deals, like hella deals actually. So, but yeah, this is so pretty. It does have the smooth leather and the leather all the way around. It's just so pretty. And then the inside is the burgundy, very similar to the chalk, chalk signature one. The glazing also, it's kind of hard to tell on this if it's as raspberry as the chalk canvas one, but it does have kind of like a burgundy glazing too for this one. So um, yeah, this one I love to wear web straps with. Like, it just makes it fun just to wear the really thick strap. This bag is killer with like a thick strap, in my opinion, because it's small. And then if you wear it like a high crossbody, it just looks, it looks effortless, it looks good. Um, but yeah, I just really, really love this one in particular. So those are my three that I do have and I'm not sure which one I'm gonna change into. I think actually, I think I wanna use my black one. So for right now, since it's still kind of winter time, I'm gonna wear this black one. So let me go ahead and do a little, you know, downsizing moment for you guys. So for this gorgeous bag, I am just, you guys, I'm just so in love with Prince of Schooler. Like I can't even handle it. There's a saddle one on Fashion File. Please no one go buy that because I may have to get that one. Like it's calling my name. So I have in this bag larger, um, I have larger stuff in this bag that won't fit in a Cassie 19. So starting with this, I'm gonna need to really downsize into, I'm gonna downsize into this guy. So 
because this one's huge and it's not gonna obviously fit like into my Cassie 19. So I'm gonna pull the things out of that and put it into my Cassie 19. And then I also have my reading glasses and this is gonna be in a soft pouch, which is good because it should fit right into my Cassie 19. And then I have a, just a card holder here by Coach. This is basically my wallet and um, overflow of cash, I just stick into a pocket inside of my bag. So this will go in and fit just fine. And then I do have a couple more things. I've got, this is like a business card holder. This is a Coach Trunlock card holder. Um, that have, I have like one card in it right now, but I definitely love this. For my sunglasses, I need to move out of my Fendi giant sunglasses case and go into a soft pouch. Do I love downsizing that much? Not really. I will be truthful with you. That's why I love like these Pro Enza bags because you never have to. Like in the medium size, they're just so good. Can't even handle it. So I just put my Fendi glasses into this soft pouch, so that should work. And then of course you have your cell phone. So I'm just gonna pop my phone to regular iPhone. I'm gonna pop that into the back pop, the back pocket of this bag and just kind of go from there. So I'm gonna go ahead and stuff it full and show you how I pack it. Well, I'm back. I ran upstairs because I thought, gosh, this strap's gonna look so cute with it. So I have my black Cassie 19 fully packed and on the inside, I have even more room to spare in this guy. I've got everything in my card holder, the catch-all, two pairs of glasses, and then the card holder. Close it on it very easily. And then in the back of the Cassie 19, your cell phone fits just fine. It does expand out just like this. And so cute. So <laughs> I ran upstairs to get this. This strap, you guys, is from the Tally Bucket Bag. So I thought it would look super cute with this bag. And let's just try it on. Because like I said, the web straps just kind of overpower the little bag, but it looks like baller. So, and please excuse my outfit. Um, Cause I'm in sweats and like have been totally a bum all day, except I have cleaned. So here's what she looks like with the web strap. Kind of hard to tell, but yeah, that's, that's how cool it is. And I mean, of course I could like lengthen it out, but um, like, I love it. Like seriously, so cool. Some people don't like love how this is so big. Like, see how chunky it is? However, that's, I, I kind of like that, you know? So that's it. That's all I got for you. So I promise I'm gonna try my best to not like space out my videos so much, but you guys, work's been nuts. I go into an office every single day and now I'm managing broker of an office. So I do, you know, oversee people and it's been going great, but I tell you what, I don't have much free time at all. Plus the market's heating up. So yeah, um, that's about it. Thank you guys so much for coming and watching and I hope you guys enjoy your week ahead. Take care, bye.